York County, the alleged ringleader of a major retail theft operation was set to stand trial today, but it didn't happen. News 8's York County reporter Ed Weinstock is outside the Judicial Center with the story. Ed. Ron, the trial didn't go forward because James Jafrida decided at the last minute to plead no contest to the charges against him. Prosecutors tell me that he made no comment before the judge, but when he is sentenced, he be, could be facing many years. It's just staggering that he was able to operate this on such a scale. Prosecutors say James Giafrito was the ringleader of an elaborate theft scam that used more than 100 people to steal for him. The overwhelming majority of them are drug addicts. Authorities say the gang stole merchandise from big box stores like Target, Kohl's, Home Depot, Walmart, and Lowe's, but they didn't keep it. Investigators say they brought it right back to the store. Without a receipt, the thieves were issued a store credit in the form of gift cards. The gift cards were then turned over to Jafrida, who bought them from the thieves at a big discount. Then prosecutors say Jafrida resold the gift cards on the internet for a much bigger profit. Prosecutors say some 250 stores across the Susquehanna Valley and Maryland were targeted over the course of a year in 2012. It's, it's really incredible the scale that Mr. DeFrieda was, was organizing this whole thing. And police say that this scam could have cost retailers across the Susquehanna Valley close to three quarters of a million dollars. And consumers could have been hurt too if retailers pass some of their losses on to their customers. Mr. Jafrida faces a maximum of 64 years in prison when he is sentenced here next month.